Negative pressure ambulances are needed to prevent COVID-19 from spreading during the transportation of patients. But it's quite difficult to acquire enough of these ambulances as they are too expensive. Instead, some fire stations have introduced negative pressure stretchers that are cheaper. An ambulance carries a suspected COVID-19 patient. The inside of the vehicle is coated with a sheet of transparent plastic film. The patient lies down in a long cylindrical container. It is equipped with a special negative pressure filter that blocks the air inside from leaking out. Used for transporting patients with infectious diseases, a negative pressure ambulance costs 200 million won. Due to the high price, these special ambulances are owned by only three out of 19 fire and disaster headquarters across the nation. Just six negative pressure ambulances belong to Seoul, Gyeonggi-do province and Gwangju. This is why negative pressure stretchers are being used as an alternative. The stretchers are cheaper than the ambulances with prices ranging between 10 million and 20 million won. Fire stations nationwide have 94 negative pressure stretchers. Fire and Disaster Headquarters of Seoul and the two provinces plan to purchase more of these stretchers, which have proven useful during the ongoing coronavirus outbreak.